Michigan health departments are seeing an increase in people seeking a booster shot and a small uptick in those getting their first dose. TV 5's Trevor Sahaki examines the reasons behind this trend. Boosters, seeing a boost in popularity. We are absolutely uh, seeing a high demand for the booster doses um, when they were announced and now with the uh, increased eligibility, our clinics have not slowed down and we've seen a consistent demand for those booster doses from all age groups. Midland County Health Officer Fred Yanoski said his department alone has put more than 3,000 boosters in arms in November. He says the Omicron variant probably helped convince some people to go for the extra jab. I think that putting risk in perspective is important. And even though this is a variant of concern, um, you know, from, from my perspective, there's plenty of reasons to be vaccinated at this point regardless. Midland has also seen a slight uptick in first dose demand as well. A good sign with winter upon us. More and more people after the six months after getting that second dose, right? We have a larger portion as each day passes that are eligible to receive their boosters. Christina Harrington is a Saginaw County Health Officer. Her department did 535 boosters last Thursday at Sears, a record for just health department staff. They also did 343 at the Dow Event Center, much higher than previous clinics. I think people now are seeing that literally millions of people have been fully vaccinated. We're seeing good statistics around you're less likely to be hospitalized. You're less likely to die from COVID. You're less likely to have a severe presentation. Harrington said just over 31,000 booster doses have been given to Saginaw County residents. Trevor Sahaki, WNEM, TV5. And if you need to get your COVID booster or your original shots, head to the hot links section on WNEM.com to find the nearest and most convenient location to you.